Hey everyone, Chef Anthony here at Don's Appliances. Today I'm going over the Wolf Transitional. This is our steam oven, so great piece in here. And first we open it up, and first off you see just, you know, ton of usable space here. So you got four good racks, convection fan dead ahead, great lighting in here. And, you know, first and foremost, it can be a convection oven, you know. So now we can really convect, cook, you could use this as a secondary oven, but the steam factor is really so important here. If we hit that water button right here, open that up, here's where our water reservoir lives. So we pull this out and fill this up with tap water. This will give us 60 to 90 minutes, depending on what we're cooking, of continuous steam. So, super fun. And don't worry about, hey, a lot of customers ask me, hey, uh, when, uh, when do I need to add water? It'll open up and say, you know, F, refill water tank. So it tells you, and it won't interrupt the cooking process. So don't think about it. Don't think you messed your souffles up, but we'll do that. I wanna talk about the interior here. I wanna talk about the pans. So this is our perforated pan. This is ideal for vegetables to kind of get that air going in between them. You know, salmon and things like that too can go on here. This is a solid for, you know, all of your solid things. Like I would cook rices on here. I cook my uh, pork tenderloin on here. Things like that go very well. So you have your two uh, trays and they are dishwasher safe for uh, convenience factors. This is great too. And now you're really gonna see the dedicated numbers. So we'll have one, two, three, and four racks. So those dedicated numbers really help out when you're using some of the features in here as well. So I said the first one, this is our steam. This is gonna be 212 degrees, okay? The next one, if we hit the arrow over button, that's our true convection. Now we can use this as a primary oven instead of steam. This third one is bringing them both together. So now we're gonna convection steam at a higher temperature. Steaming is only 212 degrees. Now in convection, you know, we can raise the cavity to 450 degrees, introducing the cooking of protein. So now we can cook our chicken, we can cook our meats, our meats and fish, you know, at a higher temperature, get a caramelization and ensure that moisture, right? Our next is convection humid. If I hit the arrow, Okay, right there. Convection humid is really going to be for items uh, with some moisture in it. Stuffed shells, you know, meatloaf, things like that. There is a damper up here, and it really puts that damper in to kind of keep more of that moisture in. Next, reheat. This is for any fully cooked item. So I always use the example of pasta and meatballs. You know what it would taste like microwave, but now in reheating in the steam kind of freshens it, brings that moisture back to the starchy items makes them fresher and more flavorful than they were. Sous vide, which is a widely popular item now. So now we can sous vide in this oven so we can cryo back our fillets, our vegetables, even our eggs, and sous vide them to the correct temperature and duration. It's super fun too, I love that. Okay, that really covers the quick start guide. You jump into the gourmet, I'll hit this gourmet and you can see, you know, here's our fruits, vegetables, kind of all of our pieces, you know, meat, poultry, anything from potatoes you know you don't want to boil your potatoes on the cooktop steam them in your oven you know and now really one dish meals fresh pizzas there's a ton in gourmet when you hit more this is really where you program your recipes more gourmet will have other recipes like fresh appetizers you know frozen appetizers it's really where you get fun souffle frozen potatoes frozen pizza setting you know pies muffins they've really thought of a ton of things in, uh, in the more gourmet. So a lot of options, a lot of outlets for you. You still have your lighting, still have your settings button to set your language, adjust your display and your clock settings and to configure any uh, notifications that you have for service related issues. So the D scale is really what I wanna talk about here. Every 600 um, uses is gonna ask you to D scale. It's really just a quick, simple 19 minute process that really kind of makes sure there's no scale buildup in the water in the steaming process. So nice and easy. And then the next, you can set the water hardness and the loudness on your speaker system here. So if you don't like the chime or it's too low, Low or you're farther away from it, you can adjust that. But ton of features, ton of finish in here. There is a dedicated timer and light, but steam oven has a ton of versatile options, ton of cooking applications for you. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much from Don's Appliances.